Hello friends. Welcome to my new Java programming tutorial series video. Today, we will discuss, how to sort an array using bubble sort algorithm in Java. Moving ahead. Friends. In this tutorial, you will learn how to sort an array using bubble sort algorithm in Java. Sorting is a process by which collection of elements are arranged in a certain order, that is, either in ascending or descending order. There are many algorithms which can sort elements. Bubble sort technique is one such way to sort. It is simplest algorithm which sorts an array by iterating from first element to last. On iterating from first to last element it compares values of successive elements and swap them either in ascending or descending order. It is given name as bubble sort because using this sorting algorithm smaller elements bubble to the top of array, while larger elements stay at bottom. Moving ahead. Let's discuss how to use bubble sort algorithm to sort elements such as, 3, 8, 5, 1 in ascending order. Here, bubble sort algorithm will make various passes on array. On each pass successive elements are compared, if they are in descending order then elements are swapped. After the first pass, the last element becomes the largest element in the array. After second pass, the second to last element becomes the second largest in the array. This process is continued until all elements are sorted. In our example, we need to sort elements such as 3, 8, 5, 1. In first pass, compare the elements in the first pair that is 3 and 8. And no swap is needed because they are already in order. Compare the elements in the second pair that is 8 and 5, and swap 8 with 5 because 8 is greater than 5. Compare the elements in the third pair that is, 8 and 1, and swap 8 with 1. The first pass places the largest number, 8, as the last in the array. In the second pass, as you compare and order pairs of elements sequentially, there is no need to consider the last pair, because the last element in the array is already the largest. In the third pass, as you compare and order pairs of elements sequentially except the last two elements, because they are already in order. Hence, elements in third pass get sorted as, 1, 3, 5, 8. Let's discuss Java code to implement bubble sort in steps. Step 1, create a Java class. Here, in our case it's bubble sort. Step 2, create a static method taking in a unsorted integer array. Here, in our case method name is bubble sort. Step 3, create a boolean variable to test whether next pass is required or not. Step 4, create a for loop having value of integer m as 1 in the initialization step. The loop will traverse till boolean condition is true. Here, on each loop it checks whether value of m is less than length of array. And next pass value is true or not. At last there is an incremental step which increments value of m by 1 over each loop. Step 5, assign a value false to next pass variable. Step 6, create an inner for loop having value of integer i as 0 in the initialization step. The loop will traverse till boolean condition is true. Here, on each loop it checks whether value of i is less than length of array minus the value of m. At last there is an incremental step which increments value of i by 1. Step 7, in each inner for loop check is done whether element at i position is greater than element at i plus 1 position. If value of element at i position is greater than value of element at i plus 1 position, then we need to swap those two values in array. With each completion of outer for loop, element with larger value sinks at last. Create a temp variable which holds value of element at i position. It temporarily hold value of i element of array. Assign the value of i plus 1 element to i element. Assign value of temp variable to i plus 1 element. 
After these three steps element at I position will have value of element at I plus 1 position, and I plus 1 element will have value of I element. Since, swapping of value is been done in the pass, hence there has to be next pass. If above if check came out to be false for iteration of outer for loop, then it confirms that array is already sorted. Moving ahead. Let's test the bubble sort algorithm. Step 1, create a main method to test bubble sort algorithm. Step 2, create an unsorted array having few elements as shown in above code. Step 3, print unsorted array on Java console with help of for loop. Step 4, pass the unsorted array to bubble sort method to sort array in ascending order. Step 5, after bubble sort method execution, print sorted array on Java console with help of for loop. Moving ahead. Let's move ahead and run the program. The main method creates first an unsorted array. Using for loop it displays unsorted array on Java console as, 3, 1, 6, 7, 0, 3, 14, 12, minus 15. It then passes unsorted array to bubble sort method to sort its elements in ascending order. After bubble sort method ends, main method proceeds further and prints sorted array on Java console as, minus 15, 0, 1, 3, 3, 6, 7, 12, 14. Thus, it sorts array elements in ascending order based on bubble sort algorithm. So friends, go through this video two to three times so that, bubble sort algorithm concept in Java gets more clear to you. Hope you like this video. Please give one minute to like, share, comment or subscribe my channel, or you can visit my website at www.hubberspot.com